what's up guys welcome back to another vlog first of all i need to stop being so vocal with my hands we're doing a monthly reset i've been waiting to do this um it was already on my mind to do it um at first i called it a deep clean but then i was like you might as well do a full monthly reset and y'all i have seen a couple videos where people have did monthly resets and like I saw no action done but them sitting down and planning. Yeah, planning is nice and I'm not debunking anybody, but y'all, why am I watching a video with people just writing their goals down and writing in their planner? Like, that is not motivating to me at all. Like, I be sitting there and watching the video for all of, I want to say a minute and a half. Like, if the video even starts out remotely with them talking a lot, quick i have some catching up to do i am getting back on track with posting in real time so i'm going to try to get this video out as fast as i can try to because i have a video that i'm editing right now and then i have one more edit to do before this video comes out so what i'm gonna try to do is edit that video then hop right into editing this next video which probably won't be as long and then get this video out before the first week of august is even over so if I'm G like that, then y'all gonna know. Y'all gonna know when this video come out if I'm G like that. Y'all, I'm doing a full rebrand, so we really gotta be on point, which is why I really wanted to do this um, this monthly reset because like it's really gonna get me where you know headed in a direction that I wanna go with this channel and um, with you guys. I got a digital planner, so your girl's gonna be a little bit more organized now so let me go to my calendar um i don't i don't know if i told y'all but me and joe are taking a different approach with our budgeting so we can kind of get ahead to pay for our house in the long run so there's a lot of things i'm gonna be going over in this video so if you guys are interested in any of the things i just said go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below become part of the gang continue watching the video and yeah let's get right into it Hey y'all, I'm about to get ready and head out to get my hair trimmed. Um, I have my outfit on already, but I'm just trying to figure out what I want to do with my hair. I think I might just leave it in that clip I just had it in until I get there. So, yeah, I just wanted to clean up clean up the, the edges a little bit before... I head out because I don't want my hair looking crazy when I walk in there even though it's a hair salon but I just want to look composed while I'm traveling there so yeah and then I'm about to change my earrings literally need to head out in like two minutes so yeah I'm gonna show y'all the outfit in a second and then we gonna head out the door. I think we're good now. I'm just gonna take some extra um, hair stuff to put my hair up depending on if it rains and such. So, got some more gloss. I finally found my gloss, y'all. It was in my backpack, packed away. So, go ahead and put kind of that on. Okay, and then I'm taking my camera tripod so I can record better this time. 
we all. So let's talk about how it's absolutely raining outside right now. Like I ran out the house and like five minutes into the drive, it started raining. Y'all. When I say Florida is so bad right now because of the tropical storms and I'm already running like I was talking to my aunt earlier and I was telling her how I wanted to start doing like more hair videos on the channel for y'all and like you know stuff with natural hair but also stuff with like straight hair and my straight new routine I already told y'all I want to do more of that once I figure out like what products really work for my hair okay um so yeah I feel like I have so much knowledge to give y'all about what I know about growing your hair and maintaining your length and you know what tools I feel like work best but you know it still all depends on your hair texture and stuff like that okay y'all so I just well not just left but yeah I just left my appointment mind y'all look no beef, no shade to my, my stylist, but y'all, I had to wait an extra, almost an extra hour. But I will say, because I was in traffic when I told y'all, so I, I didn't end up getting there until like 4.50. And she was still working on another lady. Apparently, this lady was older and she had alopecia, so obviously I was understanding. Like, I didn't find out the reason why until I got into the chair. But, I mean, at the end of the day, my hair got trimmed, so it's whatever. Only thing, y'all, it's already almost 6.30. So, I didn't get in the chair until, like, 5.30. Yeah. I didn't get in the chair until almost 5.30. Here it is, almost 6.30. So, my hair, I think my hair took, like, 30 minutes. Took, like, 30 minutes to trim. And then when I got when I came out, I got I sat in the car and did some stuff because I was working on the budget for this month. We're saving, we're doing the best we can with you know the money that we make. So um, making sure to budget every single thing that I can, including subscriptions, the rent, you know, all of that. So like minimizing costs in different places so that we can still have fun a little bit and not be bored but still we're making moves towards saving for a house because probably are going to be moving march like well not moving but buying the house in march we might not move until actually in april though so oh it's a hard thing sorry y'all i did not know y'all so um i'm finally sitting down it's been a very very long day i didn't tell y'all earlier but i went to uh work some sessions this morning from 5 a.m to 10 30 and actually not even from 4 4 45 a.m to 10 30 a.m i um was working uh coaching sessions so yeah now i'm back at home now we can do some planning so i'm about to go ahead and set up my regular calendar along with um my digital calendar that i was telling you guys about so let me go ahead and show y'all the digital calendar that i got i am using 
So it looks like this. And it says, hold on. Here we go. Uh, 2024. And you can customize the screen and everything. So I've been like doing all my planning on here so far. And then here's my content calendar. So I'm still like finishing setting that up, but I have to finish paying for the thing before, I mean for the calendar plan before I can start on it again. So yeah, we're about to get into some planning. Um, biggest thing this month is planning out content, my content schedule. So I'm gonna go ahead and write the same schedule on here so that I can see it visually because I'm not gonna have my, um, I'm not gonna have my digital planner in front of my face all the time. So I want to just go ahead and copy um, everything that I have on, right now on my digital planner for post onto my regular planner. So now that that's done, let's go and do what this month's focus is. Alright, so I'm trying to think, what do I want this month's focus to be? And I come to the conclusion that I want this month's focus to be platform platform consistency because I've been consistent on Instagram. I've got everything outlined for Instagram, but I also need to get things outlined for YouTube and videos that I want to create. But I also want to, in terms of health, make sure that I'm like drinking my, um, my green juice. I forgot what it's called right now, but basically it's good for your gut. So we want to put gut health. So like I was saying, we have a Bible study tonight. So I want to put Bible study. Um, I want to say one or two times a week. Good morning, guys. So yesterday was a very, very, very long day. Um, it is August 2nd, 9.43. Sorry. 9.43 a.m. So I've been up for like an hour y'all I was so tired like I I just know I was so tired I fell asleep so fast but we want to get ready and fold up these clothes mountain night it's not really a mountain of clothes but it's a good amount of clothes so um I feel like I did my recovery routine on here before but um yeah, we're gonna do that today and then I need to edit the weekly vlog which was supposed to go today but at this point y'all the weekly vlog is not going up to the morning because I've been so busy. Like, I've been all over the place. And I was talking to Jill this morning, but I'm trying to figure out if I want to take a small break from YouTube so that I can focus on Instagram because that's where I'm growing most right now. But at the same time, you know, I really haven't implemented implement it like um all the things that i want to do for youtube yet so i feel like i just need to give it a chance and if i get overwhelmed with trying to keep up on all the platforms then i'll take a break so like one is a hair care video one is a productive day one is like a rom romanticizing my life and then i want to do like a budgeting in your 20s video so if you guys are interested in any of those things definitely let me know in the comments I probably would have put what I would do is I probably would put a, a poll on the on the feed page I mean on the community page so you guys can vote but yeah this is pretty much what I'm doing right now so I'm gonna finish folding these clothes and then 
get ready for this recovery day. I'm folding clothes, I'm about to get ready and go to the gym. This is how my hair turned out after the trim that I got yesterday. So, she didn't trim much more off. As y'all can see, it's about the same. Um, but yeah, she pretty much trimmed off like, I wanna say like this, like this much. So, it's just about how much I thought she would trim off. So, this is how it's good. Yeah, so what I can see, it's about the same. It's not really a huge difference, but just good. That basically means that I maintained more hair. Good morning. It is 7:12 a.m. It is Saturday, August 3rd. I feel like our vlog is pretty much coming to a close. I think I just want to end today's um today off with getting my nails done because I did my hair in the last vlog for the most part, so that's done. Um, but yeah, you guys know I haven't got my nails done in like two months. So, I feel like that's what I want to do. I'm going to try to get an appointment today or either go to another nail salon. Uh-uh, don't come in here with all that. Y'all, this dog. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm thinking about doing. I'm trying to see if I'm going to leave my hair like this for this workout I'm about to go to. Because, y'all, I do not... Like, I want my curls to stay. Like, I don't want them to be. And I gotta, I gotta address this right here. Because I got some, like, short hair right here. But I've always had, like, short hair here. But, yeah, I want to keep this wave that I have in my hair. So, I think that I'm going to keep these clips in. But I need to adjust them. I feel like I've been wearing the same earrings because I have. So, we're going to find some earrings. And I literally cannot wait to get my ear pierced, my second hole, so I can have, like, a um, a stack right here. So, um, yeah. I'm about to put this white headband on. So, that I can maintain the hair here on the top. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? Oh, my. Y'all. Yeah, I was putting this headband on, but I hope being a parent is easier than being a dog parent. Because, baby, 
it's like they understand English, but they don't understand English. So, I might try to get some clips today. Yeah, I'll see y'all there. So I have four here. Yeah. Yeah. What's up? Hey y'all, I am so tired. Um, I literally, y'all, I think my hair is good though. I mean, I didn't sweat too, too hard, but y'all, when I tell you, that was, that was not, it wasn't just a, like a tough workout. Like it was more so that, um, you know, we had teams. I took a picture and I did like a little video of how many um, points that we got from doing the team thing. You guys, when I say like it was so tough because we had like a good amount of people that weren't as like physically fit. So there were like a good amount of areas where I had to like pick up slack and all that so I had like one other person with me that was like really like growing and I'll say I'll say I'll say like two other people but we you know we had a pregnant girl on our team we had an older lady on our team um we had a dude he was good and then the other girl the other lady I had she was good but it's just like y'all I'm so tired like when I tell y'all I am so freaking tired like I was pushing my boundaries. They did end up having a vendor with um you know there. So this place is called Drip. Um from it's called Drip, it's juice therapy. This one is called Island in the Sun. So it has pineapple, mango, orange, carrot, lemon, and turmeric. Um so far it tastes good. The good thing is that they did have some like Chipotle bites in there, so I ate some of those before I just left. Like, as y'all can hear me, I'm still, like, breathing hard because I'm so fatigued. Like, like my muscles are so fatigued. Like, I just know I'm going to be tired, but we have to go and find a um, nail salon to go to. The nail salon that I usually go to doesn't do gel eggs. So, I don't know if I really want to go. I don't know if I really want to go to that my nail salon. 
because I really wanted to try Gel X, but I'm trying to see how much it's going to cost. But if I go to my original studio, I'm going to have to get acrylic. And I don't want to get acrylic on my nails. Um, and then a gel top. Like, I don't want to do that. So, I'm trying to find a, a nail salon that does gel X that I can go to. Hopefully, this one that's over here by the studio will have gel X. But we'll see. So, I'm going to charge y'all right quick. And then, I'm going to head in. I'm going to I'm gonna call them to see if they, if they do gel X. But, yeah, y'all. That's it for the workout today and then we also are going to do candle making today so i feel like i'll probably just go ahead and record that part for y'all too just because we are already we already vlogging so i might as well just get that in the vlog too but yeah y'all keep up with me all right y'all so i found a nail salon i can go to but y'all, I am literally trying to figure out if I want to spend that much money on some nails, you know. Um, it's nice to get your nails done. But when I was, I was called her, she was like, yeah, we do gel legs. I was like, okay, and how much would that be? And she was like, um, depending on your nail size, it, you know, $70. I'm like, $70? I want, I, I want to try these gel X nails, but $70? I only allocated fifty five dollars for nails, baby. Look. But yeah, back in the car. Here are the nails. They're more like a brown color. I feel like I should have got them a little bit deeper because they're giving very much nude on my skin. But yeah, I can. Um, it's a little blurry. Okay, here we are. Yeah, it's giving kind of nude on my skin, even though the brown is it's a little bit more brown than I am. But overall, I like it. It's it's cute. I accidentally told her that I wanted plain, so she thought that I meant that I wanted just a, a plain coat. But then I was like, okay, I, I don't feel like having her start over, so I just accepted it. But it's still cute. Um, I wanted like a brown French, because at first she was like, the other lady was like, oh, do you just want plain, no French? And I'm like, in terms of that, I thought she meant like, because I was talking about, she said something about the base color. So then I was like, yeah, I don't want, you know, any like base color, like the pink stuff that they be putting on top to make it look natural. I didn't want that. Um, I just wanted to do it on like the natural coat of my nail. And then the French to be brown. But obviously that didn't happen, which is fine. So I'm trying to see if I'm about to go home. I wanted to get some new earrings, but um <clears throat> a lot of stores be really like overpricing for earrings so i think i'm gonna look on amazon i was looking on amazon before for some so i'm gonna go check again to see if they have any like chunky style earrings that i would like so your girl is about to head on back to the crib because I haven't ate anything this morning except a bar. I do have some snacks in here though. But yeah, I'll see y'all when I get back.
Hey y'all, back at home. So, uh, we got back like an hour ago. Um, your girl is tired. But I still gotta edit these videos. But I'm hoping that you guys have enjoyed the vlog or enjoyed this monthly reset. So much has happened in this vlog, I feel like. So, yeah, it's been a long one. And my memory card, the reason why I know it's been a long one is because my memory card is left with 30, 38 minutes right now. So, I know it for a fact it's, it's going to be a two hour vlog. But, yeah, hopefully, this um monthly reset has been motivational to you um i did want to go over my goals before we close the video for august my number one goal is to create some growth on my platforms so like all, all my platforms youtube instagram tiktok um, which I've already started to see growth, but I'm still trying to figure figure out some things mostly with my TikTok Because you guys know that I said I wanted to start a new TikTok because my old TikTok has like Videos on it from when I was in college when I was doing sports still and everything so I just feel like it's time for me to start a new the TikTok that I am on at the new one that I created though, I'm still trying to figure out the vibes for that because I had a video that I posted today and y'all, it got five, no, it got seven views compared to, um, compared to a couple of the other videos I posted, which got like, you know, 700 views. Sorry y'all, the camera stopped I, and I didn't notice. It stops at five minutes, but yeah. Um, I was saying that um, I had some video ideas that I wanted to do for you guys coming up soon. So, well, yeah, that's pretty much what I was saying. I hate when a camera cut out because I always forget what I was saying. But, um, yeah, that's the basics of what is going on, what what it is to look forward to what my goals look like for the next six months hopefully you guys were motivated you're finding where your position is and where you want to go and what your goals look like based on things that i'm going through as well so yeah this is life in your 20s and i'm just going to continue to take out my journey so see y'all in the next video.